Hey guys, what up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today's tutorial is how to make this really cool blur transitions with Vegas Pro software. And no plugin is required in order to recreate these transitions. Right, so it's not actually a transition, it's just that it has sort of a blur in between cuts, all right? And you can do it here in Vegas Pro. So here I have a two clips layout. I got my first clip and then my second clip, and I wanted transitions the effect to take place between the cuts. So all I have to do now is, is just go to the video effects tab and go to blur and we're gonna use the linear blue effects. So they already made a presets here, which is you obviously wanna use either horizontal or vertical uh, blur. So in this case, um, I maybe wanna go with the vertical one, just drag and drop on both of this video here. All right, so right now the entire clip is blurred out, but it's okay. We haven't done with the keyframes here. So what you wanna do now is for the first video clip here, we want to animate the amount of blur. So 50 is roughly good enough here, all right? So we, we press the stopwatch here to load up the amount keyframes here in the timeline. And I'm just gonna bring the first keyframe all the way till the end, all right? And then you want to count roughly about one, two, three, four. Four keyframes to the back or five, it all depends on you. Add another point here and just bring down the amount all the way to zero. So when we play, the blur gradually comes in, all right? And for the second clip here, uh, we wanna press the uh, animate for the amount here. The first keyframe, obviously you wanna leave it at uh, 50 there. And I found out roughly about seven frame forwards, which is seven frame here, all right? And just tone down the amount to zero so it gradually comes to zero so now if we play back you can see the effects start to take place it's really simple and it is really subtle but it make your video look super nice all right so i hope you guys learned something and if you have any question related you can just leave it down in the comment section and i'll try my best to help you guys so see you guys next time